Hi everyone, this is Captain Kyle. I'm here at Chiller Theater with Kirk Acevedo, who is in The Walking Dead, Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. How are you enjoying the con? Uh, it's cool. It's my first one. So, uh, and you know, I, I dig horror, and it's, it's, it's cool to meet the fans and stuff. Yeah. Very cool. So your very first con. Wow. So there goes all my questions about con experience. <laughs> well, so far at this con, have you had a, a very interesting encounter with any fans? Uh, a couple of guys showed me uh, tattoos on their legs of Oz, the HBO uh, prison show. Mm-hmm. So that, that was kind of cool. You know, they're a diehard fan if they're getting tattoos. So, yeah. Absolutely. Now, when you came here, was there anyone that you met you know, who was a, another guest here that you were like, oh, my God, I didn't think I'd ever meet them. No, you know what? For my wife, my wife loves gymnastics, so I saw that they had Olga Corbett. Mm-hmm. So I was trying to get uh, her autograph for uh, my wife, but she's not there yet. So, yeah. But that, that yeah, that would probably be a big, uh, you know, get for my wife. Uh. Very cool. So first con, and I'm sure you've seen, there's not as many here at some of the other cons. Trust me, if you're going to do some more, yeah. you're going to have a heck of a time. But you see some people dressed in costume. Yeah. What do you think about these cosplay people? Oh, I love it. I think it's cool. I mean, it's like, you know, be silly, be a big kid. And uh, I mean, I saw Predator and, you know, Elmo and, you know, and, and uh, a bunch of Walking Dead characters. And uh, I think it's cool. The Walking Dead, I'm not familiar. Yeah, I've never heard of that, too. No. <laughs> so, if you had a chance to dress up in costume and yeah. come to a con, what would you dress as? What would I? Oh, like Han Solo. I'd be Han Solo. Yeah. I could see that. You look like the type who would shoot first. Yeah, oh, yeah, shoot first. Shoot first, kill now. No questions. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, do you have anything coming up that you can talk about? I understand there's some yeah, things you can't. Uh, I'm filming 12 Monkeys right now, seasons three and four. Also, the new Insidious coming out, and uh, uh, played a lead guy, and Lynn Shea, and all Lee Wanell, and all the cast are in it too. So, uh, good ones, good one, and uh, a couple other things in the works, but uh, yeah. Very cool. And where can people find you on social media so they can follow when new things come out? Uh, I'm mostly on Twitter, so it's at Kirk Acevedo. So uh, I'm very active on uh, Twitter. Uh, the Instagram, I don't know how to do that shit. And uh, Facebook, uh, there's too many people I want to avoid, so we don't go on there. <laughs> people you want to avoid. Do you want to expand on that? Uh, you know, a couple of corpses in the closet. We want to avoid them. Yeah. yeah, well, you did some bad things, or at least you were made to do some bad things by this governor guy I heard. Yeah, yeah the governor. Yeah, <laughs> he's dead to me. Killed my brother. Yeah. I've actually seen him, like, walking around alive. It's kind of weird. Yeah. Do you have your eye patch? <laughs> Not with me, no. At home? Good, good. <laughs> but I can uh, talk like the governor if you'd like. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. You did a good job. <laughs> so, I got three silly questions for you. Let's go. What is your favorite ice cream flavor? Strawberry. Strawberry? I didn't peg you as a strawberry guy. What did you think I was going to be like? Chocolate? Or... I figured you would be like, you know, cookie dough. Or Cherry Garcia. But it's kind of like another cherry, strawberry, same thing. Yeah. All right. Now, if there's an actor that you could get to work with, yeah. even if they passed away and you could bring them back to life so that you could work with them, who would you really want to work with? Uh, there's only two. Uh, that would be Daniel Day-Lewis or Marlon Brando. That's it. Those are good choices, though. Yeah, they're all right. <laughs> and final question. If you could have any superpower, what superpower would you like to have? Read and minds. Read minds. I'd rule the world. You think reading minds would allow you to, to rule the world? Think about it. I can make money very easily. Let's say playing poker. I know what they have in their hands. Right there, millions, right? Uh, read minds, uh, you know, uh, it, it, yeah, read minds. All right, we got to make sure this guy never learns how to read minds because that would be bad for all of us, right? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> all right, anything you want to say to your fans and supporters out there? Oh, just love that, the you know, they give their time and spend their time to watch the shows that we do. I think it's really cool. And, uh you know, uh, hopefully uh, I'll keep on doing work they like. Yeah. 
Awesome. Well, Kirk, it was awesome speaking with you. Um, thanks for tuning in. That's all we have for now. But as always, have fun and cosplay on. Hi, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please like and share, and we love to read your comments. Don't forget to subscribe and click the little bell icon to get notifications of our new videos every Tuesday and Thursday. Thanks again, and we'll see you on the con floor.